He is a theory. Tails is the fastest thing alive, not Sonic. Okay, wait, wait right there. I know, I know what you guys are thinking. What, what are you talking about? How is Tails faster than Sonic? Is it because you can beat Sonic in the Tails levels in Sonic Adventure? No, Tails was cheating. He was taking shortcuts. But Tails does move faster than Sonic in Sonic 4 Episode 2. Wanna know how? In Sonic 4 Episode 2, there was a new move introduced where Sonic and Tails could combine their powers to do something a little new. So Tails could carry Sonic in the sky, and Sonic and Tails could both spin together to create a powerful, unlimited spin dash. And of course, Tails and Sonic both had to be in the same area to do these moves. So if you activate the super move, Tails just jumps out at Sonic at a super fast speed so they can do that super combo move. But when you first look at it, you, you're like, hey, you know what? Nah, Tails is not faster than Sonic. Sonic has moved even faster than that, especially in the Sonic CD opening cutscene. This is where the environment comes in. Look at the environment when you activate the super move. Everything comes to a halt, everything stops moving. The only things moving in the scene now are Sonic and Tails. Heck, even the timer stops. You know what that means? When Tails is moving towards Sonic at such a speed, and the environment seems to have just stopped moving completely, Tails is moving way faster than the speed of sound. He's probably moving at the speed of light. Now, I'm not gonna look at this scientifically, but if time completely stops and Tails can cover for example, the distance as shown in this clip, I think that he's moving faster than the speed of light here. Or at least around about the speed of light. And even though Sonic moves as well during the whole environmental freeze, he doesn't seem to be covering any distance, he's not moving from where he is, he's kind of just spinning and then grabbing onto Tails. He's obviously processing what's happening and can keep up with the speed that Tails is moving at. But again, he doesn't show that he can move as fast as Tails, rather he can process things and move at a similar speed as Tails when standing on the spot. But unfortunately, the theory kind of falls apart here. In Sonic 4 Episode 2, there is a multiplayer mode where there are two players, one controls Sonic and one controls Tails. When the player controlling Tails presses the button to combine and do the super move, Sonic, just like Tails, jumps towards Tails and then they do the super move together. So obviously Sonic can move at that light speed that Tails is moving at. Which makes me sorry for Tails, you know, Sonic is considered the fastest thing alive, but also Tails is the fastest thing alive, they're pretty much the same speed. Now before you guys go like, oh, this is a game mechanic, you know, you don't want enemies just walking into you while you're vulnerable, and that may be true, again, the timer stops. I think if it was a game mechanic, the timer would just keep going. It's strange for the timer to stop. Take this part from Sonic Unleashed, for example. The world slows down so that you can do the quick time events, but the timer is still moving at its regular speed. It doesn't slow down with the world. And this also goes for Sonic Colors and Sonic Generations. Even when the environment slowed down, the timer is still in sync with real world time. So this strange extra detail in Sonic 4 Episode 2 may be proof that Sonic and Tails can move so fast that you wouldn't even notice. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. If you thought this was a pretty cool video, you know, leave, leave a like. And if you want to see more of these, subscribe because I'll definitely be making more behind the blur videos. It's actually pretty interesting that in the games, Sonic has finally moved so fast that you wouldn't even see it. Because both Sonic and Tails do that in the Sonic anime movie, which is pretty interesting that he's finally done that in the Sonic games now. Or at least, someone's finally noticed it.